What step would you propose for ending mass incarceration? Now, hear me out. Hear me out, guys. I'm... I have a PhD in... Uh, what's, that, what's that noise? Oh, oh, sorry. Oh. Yeah. Hey. Hey, hey turn, oh turn your phone. Oh. Hey, your phone. Hey. <laughs> hey, your, hey, your phone. Oh, hey, how... How are you oh doing? Gosh. Josh, it's that very hey, simple. Hey, That's hey, not hey, even how a phone no works. Self. All hail the Pledge of Allegiance. Uh, also, <laughs> Happy New Year. Well, hey everyone, 2020 is over, which means everything's gonna go back to normal. So for my New Year's resolution this year, I decided I wanted to become more powerful. I am a greedy, power-hungry piece of shit, and all I want to do is enact revenge on those who've wronged me. So, I ran for president. Now I know you're probably thinking, no, you didn't. The presidential election already ended. Here's the thing, there is a different one. See, there's this goofy little Discord server that I frequent sometimes called Wideburger, put together by some people that come from my hometown and other places. It's a pretty cool server, the link for the Discord is in my description if you want to go join. It's a fun place, it's got some gamers, it's cool. They held a presidential election a while ago, and I ran for president. That was a fun experience, really funny, good times, but uh, I figured I might as well show you guys my campaign. Now, this presidential election wasn't like other presidential elections. Uh, you see, they're stupid. And you can see the difference in their responses to some questions uh, right here. Given the ongoing <laughs> COVID-19 crisis, what, would, what should be done to ensure that November election is free, fair, and secure? I believe we should not wear any masks and open mouth kiss each other. I think that would be splendid to uh, make sure the virus can spread its wings, and then eventually fly away. Now while that was, uh, really stupid, there was one, one candidate, one contestant, that stuck out as my main competition. And that was Herr Sturm. He actually had intelligent answers, which frightened me. So, how will you engage with government scientists, public health experts, and researchers, especially in ongoing efforts to address the pandemic? It's simple. We have to come to a consensus on what this virus is, what it really does to people, how accurately, how well it can spread, and how to mitigate that spread. The sooner we all do that, the sooner we can all go to our local McDonald's, get a double quarter pounder with cheese, extra fives in a shake, and not have to worry about whether or not grandma and grandpa are gonna go to hell. Objection, we can already go to McDonald's and do that, you bastard. Can't wait, right. go to hell. McDonald's is a liberal hoax. You can wait, shut the fuck up! Yeah, so that's that was scary. Uh, also, this is several days after the last few clips, uh, so that you don't have to look at that hideous eye thing anymore. Uh, that was disgusting, but I'm not gonna re-record those, so we're we're gonna keep going from here. But you all know me. I gotta call him out on this shit. I need a better chance of becoming president. Yeah. I'm saying that I feel the like there's a lot of empty promises being made decision. here. Give me a break. What a load of baloney. I love baloney. Oh I really God. don't like baloney. I love oh, that I speaks to the character uh, of both people who just responded to me. I have this is fun. I've been here for like a couple minutes and I'm already enjoying it. <laughs> yeah, vote for me by the way. Yeah, anyway. I joined about ten minutes ago and now I might be president. What happened? <laughs> now it's been about 30-ish minutes into the debate now, and, and something occurred to me, uh, I haven't been asked a single fucking question. <laughs> so... I haven't gotten asked a question yet. <laughs> this is actually true. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> blame the moderator. <laughs> no, yeah, that's mean. It was his fault, though. No, I feel like I just didn't no, stick out enough. That's fine. This is it. I, I finally get asked a question. I can I can talk about my policies. I can I can talk about how I'm gonna change change this place for the better. Question number one. Sure. You shit. 
Do I? <laughs> I haven't shit since I was a kid. Genius. I don't know how Snail got in the office. I don't know what he's doing here. He really thinks he'll become president, and I can respect it, but I have no idea what's going on. What Listen, my policies are airtight. All right. So that round was a bust. Uh, maybe the next round, I'm going to get some good, some good hard-hitting questions. You know? Just got to... Just gotta wait my turn. That's all. So that was the. Uh, I don't like you did. Final. That was the final set of questions, right? No, I need you a literally question. Literally skip snail. Yeah, snail never got a question. <laughs> I've been asking oh, the entire time. <laughs> okay. No, I snail. I didn't see. I didn't see on this. This is biased. The media is biased. He is biased. We well, knew this already. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I like snail. Ask him a question. This entire process is literally rigged against me. The election is actually rigged against me. I'm not even being asked questions at this point. What am I gonna do? This is stupid. Mr. Snail, Mr. Snail, Mr. Snail, Mr. Slayer, Mr. Snail. Can you find me Wario Land? Yeah, give me one second. Where is Wario Land Shake It for the Nintendo Wii? Hey, that's a good game. Sorry, Is woman. that a dragon? Yeah. yeah. Is he gonna eat you? Uh, hold on, watch this. Watch this. Ah, uh, my 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 eye. The difference. Ah, oh no, your eye. What's so oh, you're blind now. Her? That was awful. That was that was a, just a terrible performance by myself. What am I gonna do? You you know I I failed this first debate there's no way i got any support from anyone from that they didn't even remember to ask questions to me i i'm ruined but then they hosted a second debate and i knew i thought to myself i knew i had to turn this all around and this was my only chance i got this hello i am owner job i will be moderating this debate we will be speaking one at a time and i will ask questions some will be for everybody, some will be individual. I'll specify if. Yeah. Um, so, Jared, if you'd like to introduce yourself and your party. Oh. Uh. Hi. I'm. I'm Snail, or Jared, or whatever. Uh, and my party is. I'm sorry, we were supposed to come up with parties. Yet again, I'm left out of the loop. No one tells me anything, and then it makes me look stupid and dumb. Now, my my only hope is that somehow that fucker Hair Sturm doesn't, d didn't, also didn't know to do that. I am Senator Sturm of the Fuck Community College. Let's get drunk and eat chicken fingers party. So, let me, let me start off by going to, um, Mr. Jared. Oh, hi. Rumor has it, I've heard yeah. some allegations that you are in fact Jared from Subway. That is, that is a false claim. I've this never is a eaten Subway. In fact, I actually have a job interview at Jimmy John's. So oh, if I was shit. Jared from Subway, oh, yeah, why would I? Where's the proof? Where's the proof? Where's the proof? I need to- you want me to, I'll pull up the emails. I'll pull up the emails record. right do now. Do not yeah. interrupt yeah, each dude. other, you fuckwads. Here we are, here we are. Um, from Jimmy John's Gourmet Sandwiches. See, that's that's fake. I think that's kind of general fake. manager at the Jimmy John's. Okay, for well, for you know being a, I I I have to point this out because oh. this is troubling me a little bit. Can could you scroll back up a bit, please? Sure thing. Uh, the 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 grammar and and more importantly the typos here. I I must say are mm -hmm. considering that this is supposedly a general manager. Well, I can't very manager, unprofessional. Okay. No exactly. apostrophe in the I'm, lowercase I in I'd, well, lowercase T in third. Okay. Exactly. Putting exactly. the question mark, the, putting the question mark after the exclamation point. This fucker, this motherfucker is trying to call me out. This is a legit email from my Jimmy Johns. What the fuck? I might not have fully accepted it before. But now I know for a fact, Herr Sturm is my mortal enemy. Now, since he was gonna try to mess me up, I figured I'd make uh, his life here a living hell. Why is he playing Snake? 
<laughs> Let me get a high me. score, please. God damn it. You get a high score, you're president. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. <laughs> now, this is a social initiative that is going to encourage keck behavior and discourage cringe. Uh, if, if keck be. <laughs> Mr. I'll... Snail, please. I'm speaking. And I'm playing Snake. So, I'm just playing Google Snake here. He's trying to talk over it, but that's fine, whatever. I know what people are gonna pay attention to. But then he starts talking about how he wants to add this new currency called, like, Fingies or something. What is he on? If they consented to the transaction, then I don't see a problem in that. What is okay. the exchange rate on Fingies to U.S. currency? Well, there isn't an exact exchange exactly. rate, an exact mm. solid exchange rate, because in fact, unlike really the United mm. States dollar, mm. fingies are based on the gold standard. Oh, Therefore, no, and as a wrong. result no. of which, they are far more stable than the US no. dollar. No. No. Yes, they are. No. This whole idea is horrible. You can keep saying no all you want, but it's the truth. Sorry, high score is talking. Can't hear you. Um, <laughs> okay. But, also, at the same time, I do like the proposal. These people are yapping on too much at this point, so I'm gonna do some research mid-debate to find out what the fuck I'm gonna talk about next. What he says, as I will want the upvotes to be what counts as what me six says next. Then, then he'll be sent to jail, which will be his, 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 just his own separate chat, and it'll be, just be his jail. Nice. <laughs> uh, um, Josh, I have acquired um some very interesting information okay. about um our candidate Chris Snail. Yeah. This is blasphemy. I have a very very important question for you. Yeah. What is your stance on women? I did not prepare for this. Please don't look at my screen share. Okay, I didn't look at me. <laughs> typically, typically a woman has two X chromosomes and is capable of pregnancy and giving birth from puberty. So basically, um... <laughs> too much for his brain to handle. <laughs> Christmas pie. Snail, I must object. What do signs have to do with your opinion? Snail, on this is, Snail, this is very nonsensical. And... Okay, hold on, hold on. I just had to formulate an opinion. I can, I'm just, I had to formulate. Based on stocks? I okay, am fine. currently not a fan. They don't sound too fun. Okay. I will do more research into the subject and get back to you at a later date. Okay. <laughs> Don't Google women with a question mark. Okay. I think that was a good answer. I think we covered up for our lack of information. We might have a chance here. We might have a chance here. Now I need to talk about my, my presidential plans, which Steven brought up for me. No, no, full disclosure. Actually, I was looking over um, my fellow candidate Snail's presidential plans that they so graciously shared with us in the political chat, and I was not expecting the simplicity of their platform. It's very easy to understand. You see, it I is very easy to understand. So, here was the big moment at the end of the debate. The big, say whatever you want speech. It's now. Mm. I can speak? Yes. Great. I'd just like to say a thing or two here as we're wrapping this up. I know. Not many people here in Wideburger know my name. I know not many of them know the picture of a snail that is my profile picture. But I believe that Wideburger believes in in heart, in spirit, and in funnies. And I feel like tonight I provided plenty of all of them. Because at the end of the day, Wideburger, it's not just a Discord server, you know? It's a place. A place of of, of funnies, of, of, of keck, and also of cringe, of humor of all kinds, and most importantly, of gamers. And I feel like I, representing the gamer party and those affiliated with it, will show the Wideburger people what they really need. 
Thank you, Mr. Moderator. Wow. Well said. I fucking killed it. I did such a good job on that, dude. Oh my god, I should be an actual politician. Now all that was left to do was wait a few weeks, and then the votes were going to get tallied up and we'd find out who the winner is. So that's exactly what I did. I waited for a few weeks, played some more video games, did some shit, and then it was time. The day had arrived. I see this notification in Discord. And then, the votes start coming in. Now I voted for myself, obviously, but then as I start to read more, I realize I'm not getting a lot of votes. Except for Adam. Thanks, Adam. I'm getting no votes. But you know who is? Sturm. Now it was my only goal to make sure that he didn't win. I was hoping and praying and crossing my fingers that he didn't win, constantly tallying the votes up in my own head using calculators and math and making sure that he didn't have enough votes to win. And he didn't. He didn't. Someone else was going to come in first. I was so happy. I was elated. And then I see this message. He combined his votes with the person who got first. What the fuck? Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Uh, sorry for the late upload. I got distracted and also, you know, just it happens sometimes. Also, sorry I looked like shit for the first half of the video. I always look like shit, but you know, I'll try to be better at it. I get, I'll get lights and a better camera or something. Also, if you wouldn't mind, uh, if, if you've watched all the way through, consider subscribing liking the video and maybe clicking that bell down there so you get notified every time I upload. I try to upload weekly on Fridays, obviously except for this upload, but uh, it's really appreciated. Anyways, I just wanted to say thank you again for watching and I will uh, see you next week.